Welcome back, everyone. So, we've thoroughly discussed our casting options for the Chioria Boutique commercial, but the content of the commercial is also important, right? Do you have any ideas? Hmm. If we're making a commercial for Chioria Boutique, then how about we include some event footage of Chiori? Oh, <gasps> yay! Chiori is actually going to appear in the event for version 4.3. What? Hmm. While the travelers have been able to see her store in the Court of Fontaine, they'll finally get to meet her in person. Yes, I know. Travelers can also look forward to meeting Ayaka and Ayato in Fontaine. Chiori suggested that they should stop by, so here they are. So cool. Hey, this is actually the perfect time for a word from our sponsor. An Inazuma-born fashion icon, Chiori. Chiori Boutique is your one-stop shop for the latest and most influential fashion in Fontaine. <laughs> <laughs> that is right. Chiori is acquainted with the Kamisato siblings because she's also from Inazuma. She actually introduced Ayaka and Ayato to Xavier and recommended that they make the trip to Fontaine for the Fontanalia Film Festival. So exciting! Will you tell us more about the Fontanalia Film Festival? Oh, the Fontanalia Festival was established to commemorate the legendary Loch Knights. According to the myths, they went on a quest to search for the Oceanids and eventually welcomed the Hydro Archon Egeria to Fontaine. Mm hmm. It's one of the most important festivals in Fontaine, like what the Windbloom Festival is to Mondstadt and Lantern Rite is to Liyue. Mm. Ah, so exciting! Mm -hmm. <laughs> the Fontaine Film Association proposed the Fontanalia Film Festival earlier this year. And during this time, the public may submit films for evaluation. The entry with the highest score will be given the Farina Award by the association. Well, we can see Farina working with Ayaka and the others here. So wait, does this mean that there's a chance that Farina might win the Farina Award? Okay, now I'm intrigued. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to leave you in suspense. If travelers are curious about what Ayaka and the others are doing in Fontaine, or how Farina fared, you'll just have to play the event when the new version becomes available. Hmm. So we know that several friends from Inazuma will be in Fontaine for the Fontanalia Film Festival, but travelers have so much more to be excited about. Travelers will also have the opportunity to participate in a variety of activity booths during the festival. Each one will have a different theme. Ooh. <laughs> ah, so cool. The first activity booth is the Thousand Pace Interdiction Arc Minute Sharpshooting Zone. In this activity, travelers will use the Special Security and Surveillance Patrol simulation device to practice targeting and shooting opponents. Yep. Ooh. The Special Patrol wanted the public to experience how fun target practice can be. <laughs> and the second activity booth is called Trick Shots Tricky Lights. In this activity, travelers will use the studio's special lighting effects to film a fight scene. Take advantage of the buffs brought about by the special lighting effects to defeat an endless stream of opponents and obtain a higher score. So cool. Those special lighting effects are really giving off old movie vibes. Navia's mm. movements are also super smooth. It's all so atmospheric. Oh, for yeah. sure. But not everyone is enjoying the fun and games. Travelers will meet a contract employee at the third activity booth. She needs some help with her demanding client. During the activity Extreme Drive, travelers will help her test out stabilization mecha balls. Look at how the traveler chases after those stabilization <laughs> mecha balls. Okay, I bet that contract employee can relate since she's being chased down by that client. <laughs> totally. <laughs> stabilization mecha balls seem pretty ordinary, but they're actually very agile. They'll automatically avoid all testers by moving in the opposite direction of your movement. You can find jump boosters around the testing grounds. Travelers can use them to jump higher and further, which is perfect for quickly traversing to the other side of a stabilization mecha ball. Travelers in co-op matches will have to find a way to herd as many stabilization mecha balls into their target area as possible within the time limit. The more mecha balls that end up in your area, the more points you'll earn. The fourth activity booth is called Into the Frame. In this activity, travelers will get to shoot their own scenes by experimenting with different camera positions and narration techniques. Cool, we get to make a movie. That's yeah. awesome. <laughs> Travelers might remember helping out Xavier with some filmmaking back in Inazuma, but this seems more professional. Wait, maybe this can be the inspiration for our commercial. Oh. Now that I think about it, a Fontanian man went to Inazuma to shoot a film. I guess international travel can be a source of artistic inspiration. 
That must have also been true in Chiori's case, since she opened Chioria's boutique in Fontaine. Ooh, that could be a strong theme for our commercial. Actually, 